Hey guys, so as some of you may know, I recently kind of got into Game of Thrones. Um, I'm also pretty into nail art. I do my nails about every three to five days. Well, it came time to do my nails again, and I thought, hey, why not do a Game of Thrones thing? This tutorial will kind of show you my design and how you can go about doing it. So, let's get started! For this tutorial, I'll be using hydrogen peroxide, although you can also use isopropyl alcohol in either 70% or 91% alcohol, or even vodka or whiskey. I hear those work too. I have a small cup to put the hydrogen peroxide in. We have base coat. Our dark color. Um, I'm using black since I'm doing house dark, but you could use other colors if you're doing one of the other houses. Uh, accent color. This is Avalanche by China Glaze. It's not a straight on silver, it's kind of a purplish, lilac ish silver. Um, I love it, it's really pretty, and I thought it'd be cooler than just a straight up silver. And a top coat. And we're also going to have nail polish remover and q tips on hand, as well as a striper and dotting tool for um, the wolf design. Also, I went ahead and printed off winter is coming thing lines, um, different text sizes, and um, they're backwards, so the transfer will be easy to read. Starting off with the base coat, just going to paint my nails to prepare them. Now we're going to paint every finger except for the thumb. While we're waiting for that to harden, let's go ahead and paint the thumbnails. You're going to paint this in your dark color. Here we have um, the pieces that I'm going to be using for the transfer. I don't think I can stress this enough. Before you start the transfer, make sure your nails are dry, like absolutely dry, um, hardened even, not just dry because otherwise you're going to get smudges and you might get paper residue and that's never a good thing. Okay, so um, I've tried a couple different methods. The one I'm going to show you is the one that I found works a little better, at least for me. So you're going to dip the paper in the um, hydrogen peroxide or the isopropyl alcohol, whatever you've chosen to use, and then you're going to place it over your nail and just kind of press it down. If you hold it too long, you risk the um, possibility of leaving paper when you pull off um, the little strip, and that's never a good thing. You don't want to do that because it makes your nails look really gross. But if you do end up with paper left on your nail, simply run your nail under some water after, um, after the alcohol's kind of dried off and it'll remove the paper. Go ahead and uh, when you're done with the words, just um, clean up the edges of your fingers. You can just use a Q-tip and actually just water if you want. The ink will come off really easily. Um, and if you have any paper left over on your nails, again, just water and be very gentle with it. And then, Add a top coat real quick. All right, so now I'm gonna kind of start on the wolf. Um, I'm gonna put the wolf on my thumbs. Bear in mind, I'm not an artist, and there are probably much better ways to actually paint this but um, I don't really know any, so I'm just going to stick with kind of what I do know. Mm, my dire wolf's kind of more of a derp wolf, but... 
I know you guys will forgive me for that, right? Right? Okay. For the details on the wolf, I used a dotting tool, and while the silver nail polish was still wet, I just kind of etched it out. I went with kind of the scalish looking design that I saw on one of the sigils. Finish the etching, let the silver dry, cover it with a fast drying top coat, and you're done!